I'm Jason. I'm Todd. This is our little child, Ziggy. Say hello, Ziggy. Hi, Ziggy. And we're the Glamping Guys. Hey guys, so far so good. Our first road trip is going great. We're uh, about an hour outside of Charleston, but uh, we're gonna be staying at James Island Campground, which is about six miles outside of Charleston. So we're just all kind of enjoying the ride, towing the fifth wheel, no problem at all. I was a little nervous yesterday, but I've got that confidence now and uh, it's, it's going great going really, really good. So yeah, we're having a good time. Good morning. It's a little bit of an overcast, kind of light rainy day today. It's actually kind of nice and relaxing. We're in Charleston and we are staying at the James Island County Park. And I thought I'd just kind of give you guys a little walk around, show you some of the park today. Here's our setup. Uh, they have full hookups. Uh, you're allowed to stay here at the county park for up to 28 days during a 30 day uh, period. So I'm not sure what that means. Maybe you have to leave for two days, then you can come back the next month and stay for another 28 days. I have no idea. If uh, you can do that, that's pretty cool. The um, Wi-Fi is complimentary and it's actually not that bad at all. I've been able to uh, stream YouTube and Netflix. And we use T-Mobile and I've only got one to two bars of LTE, but uh, it's also good enough to be able to use my phone as a hotspot and do some streaming. So as far as the um, amenities, uh, everything here is really nice as well. You can see the uh, sites are just very, very large. We're actually staying at site number 35. There we are again. Uh, over here, are the bathrooms and I'm not going to go inside but I figured I would just walk over here and show you uh, the facilities and then right over here are the bathrooms and uh, the bathrooms are really really nice but today we're going to drive the truck around the county park uh, this place is huge but they apparently have a, a dog beach which is on their main lake. They also have a crabbing and fishing pier. You can go crabbing, and I was inside the camp store yesterday, and they actually had uh, crabbing nets and crab traps. So I don't know if you need a license or anything like that, but um, I thought that was kind of cool. The park is also famous for their Christmas light festival. They're already actually um, putting up all their Christmas lights throughout the, uh, the main roads of the park. But I thought I would bring you right down here. Here's a little fishing pond, which is really cute. And they have a little trail that walks around it. And then look at that. They have like a couple of like little light porch swings where you can sit here and kind of chill out. I enjoy the rain. I find it very, very peaceful. You know, I love the way the air smells, you know, when it rains and it just, you know, everything's just has a very uh, peaceful, like serenity and quietness about it. But anyway, here's the pond. Okay, so now we're gonna go check out the fishing dock real quick and see what that's all about. So that's probably, I guess, uh, then the bike trail that continues around the lake. Oh my God. Oh, Little bitty crabs. Oh, okay. It's everywhere. 
Oh my god, Same. yeah. Check it out. <laughs> That's too funny. There's like little baby crabs in the woods. Aww. Yeah, you probably won't be able to see them. They're kind of tiny and they blend in. Oh, this is nice. A little picnic and grill area. And uh, people are bringing their fishing poles. This is exciting. This obviously must be a good spot. I still thought that was funny. I've never seen like little, little like fiddler crabs like in the woods. Wow, this is just gorgeous. This is spectacular. I know, it's beautiful. Oh, I know. <laughs> and this takes you right out on it. Oh, here's a crab sign. Blue crab legal minimum size. Oh, okay. So it's just a uh, little chart. So if uh, they're under five inches, you got to throw them back. This is like really cool. Oh, in fact, I think those uh, guys right over there, I think they might be crabbing. I just noticed uh, there's a rope down in the water. When I was really young, uh, I used to go crabbing a lot when uh, I lived closer to the ocean. And uh, I would just go and just get some turkey necks or some chicken necks and you just tie them in a crab cage, you throw it down in the water and uh, just wait a little while and then pull it up. Oh, and this guy's pulling it up, look. Yeah, let's kind of zoom in a little and see. going on. Oh, I guess he put it back in the water. This is really pretty. Hi, how are you? Some people out on the uh water in their little boats. He's got a fishing pole. Very, very pretty. So this is the crabbing and the fishing pier. Got into the dog park. Hey everybody. Look how huge this place is. Mm -hmm. Right over there, they have a doggy wash station. And down past that dude with the dog is the lake. And I think right down there is the doggy beach and that's where we're gonna be going. But look how huge this is. One thing I really like about this place too way over back there where you see the fence. Um, that is the small dog area. So they have a separate place for your small dogs. So I guess if uh, you're worried that like a bigger dog, you know, might like, get a hold of your small dog, <laughs> you uh, can just take them over there. But we're gonna keep Ziggy on the leash for right now. And once we get down to the beach, and if uh, the other dogs seem to be kind of friendly and not aggressive, uh, we'll take him off the leash and see what he wants to do. Check it out. Dog beach. <laughs> Look at all the dogs just running around. Oh, another dog wants to say hi. Look at all the dogs. Look at all the dogs. Siggy. <laughs> Siggy. I know, look at all the dogs! Hey guys. Check this out. Oh look, you have another friend right there. Go play. <laughs> That's not so bad, is it? Okay. 
<laughs> oh, somebody your own size. There you go. Hello. This is a Pomeranian too, believe it or not. Mm-hmm. It is adorable. It's beautiful. I shaved her. <laughs> yeah, we, we did too. We're actually just starting to let them grow out yeah. for uh, the cooler months. I just got her from the shelter. Well, she's adorable. She I love um the eye. It almost kind of reminds me of like a... a there's a new breed of Pomeranus. I think it's called a Pomsky. Yeah. Where it's a husky, a husky and a palm. She came in as a stray. Yeah. But like when I groomed her, she sat the whole yeah. time yeah. like she'd been professionally groomed before. I'm sure. So, and she sits and she'll roll over and she'll shake. Oh, wonderful. Oh. oh. <laughs> Woo. They're having fun. Hey Ziggy, you want to come down by the water? Ziggy, go in the water. Look! Look at the doggies! Go say hi! See, he's good. Ziggy, go get him! Go get him! Go get in the water! Oh, he's taking a squat in the water. <laughs> Look at the doggies! Look at the doggies! Everybody's saying hi. I know, it's doggies! It's doggies! She's just like Mula. Is your Is your Pomeranian vocal? Oh, yes. Very. Yeah, it's funny. He, um, he has, like, like he... he it sounds like he's growling. Yeah. But um, he has like different pitches and different growls. It's almost like he has a language. Same but um, with her. he's yeah. always been fine with dogs. But he, I don't know. I don't know if he's just kind of doing his little yeah. dominance yeah. thing or whatever. Well, but he's. He did, that one dog oh! there, he who was very feisty and adorable. Uh oh uh oh no no you're all wet. Bit, this so. is our first time to a dog park with her and her. Oh okay. That was fun hanging out at the dog beach. We're just kind of walking around exploring. And uh, we came down to this other like, little dog beach. So we just thought we'd come and check this out because it looked really pretty. Look at that. He's having fun. All right. But very pretty. Leave a comment to say hi. If you like us, please subscribe. And if you don't, our little fluffy dog will attack you. Arr!